Hey, somebody tell this little nigga, look, I don't know this, and I don't do all this internet shit, but I'm a crazy old man, so somebody tell this little nigga this. I wasn't even talking about him, you understand? I wasn't even talking about you, you understand, little nigga? But what you do is that y'all get on this internet, y'all make these internet niggas, these social media niggas who's running y'all internet and running y'all labels, or little word, um, um, white nerd niggas that spend money on pussy in the club, and then academics and all y'all playing with y'all little niggas' life, y'all playing with real niggas, you understand what I'm saying? You hear me, little nigga? All right, cool, because I'm 2-0 for the year already on parole, nigga. Million dollars up, nigga. 2-0 for the year already, nigga. Stop fucking playing me. Anyway, long story short, I was even talking about you, little nigga. But you, you got yourself some shit. You know what I'm saying? You got yourself some shit. Cause I make my money anyways. I make a hundred grand a week. I still do this. You know what I'm saying? Still do this while I'm being blackballed. I don't give a fuck about no views. I'm not a little kid like no. Yeah, nigga. 28 years old, I'm a grown ass man, I'm in here for money, but when I catch y'all little niggas, or DJ Academic, everybody bro, any nigga I catch, like whack, any y'all niggas, I can record this, I'm going to boom them on camera, on camera live, on parole, I don't give a fuck, I'm gonna boom on y'all niggas on camera, on show on my dead grandmother nigga, fuck is wrong with y'all niggas, next nigga call my name, and niggas who called my name already, and whack, all y'all niggas, when I catch y'all on my dead grandmother, I'm gonna boom y'all, on camera, I don't give a fuck, you know what I'm saying, so y'all let these niggas who, Put all these shits out, these memes and all this shit about y'all. Y'all ask questions first, like a grown man to say, did bro talk about me? Because I call names. I'm going to call your name. Like, I'm going to shoot you. When I catch you, I'm going to shoot you. Like, whack. when I catch him, I'm going to boom him. What about that grandmother? When I catch him, no way I can see him ever in my, in my face. So when y'all call my name, make sure y'all know this. This is why I smile like this. And I walk around with a million dollars of jewelry. With, with uh, you know me. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Two over the year, baby. Um I do this for no Instagram. I do this because I get money. I'm, I'm independent, stupid. I make 10000 per song a month. Residual. Who needs real estate? What the fuck you talking about? And I'm about to go into real estate. This little nigga's crazy. I wasn't even talking about you. You know what I'm saying? Like, damn. But cool. All right. I said, I mean, shit. Cool. Right. It looks like Bobby Shmurda just responds and... I can't even tell if he's trolling or not. It looks like he wants some smoke with NBA Youngboy. And I feel like that's not the smartest idea possible. So pretty much I'm just gonna kind of break all this down really quickly, just off the top, you know what I'm saying? But it looks like Bobby Shmurda is pretty much saying that, yo, he beat two different cases in one year and he makes over 100K a week just off music. And he's also independent. And then he also is stating that he makes 10K every single song. But let's quickly just compare that to NBA Youngboy. NBA Youngboy is pretty much runs like he's independent. He recently just signed a brand new deal for 40 million. I believe it's only like one year, which is absolutely insane. And obviously NBA Youngboy is on house arrest right now and he's hoping to beat another case in a different state as well. But this whole situation is kind of, kind of funny. I don't even know if it's actually real. Like. I don't know if Bobby Schmurter really wants to smoke with NBA Youngboy. Like, I really hope he's trolling, and I'm really curious on NBA Youngboy's response. So stay tuned, because I'm going to cover Bobby Schmurter's response, or at least NBA Youngboy's response, and to keep going back and forth. And we're going to see what's going to happen in this, because this could be some real rap beef right now. Bobby Schmurter versus NBA Youngboy. Whose side are you on? Right now, it's like in a situation where it's like, I have a feeling, I think Bobby Shmurda is probably just gonna back off and be like, you know what, like, I'm just joking. But let's, let's quickly find out though. Let me know in the comments what you guys think about this whole situation. 